My name is Trevor Wayne and I'm an artist uh, based in Los Angeles. My idea was to take all these old, really iconic scenes, like stills from these horror movies that are so classic that, you know, I have friends that were, are totally afraid of, won't watch, or, and, and take the threat away and replace it with something so silly that, you know, you kind of just look at it in a different way and it makes you laugh, even though it's like this terrifying moment in film history. And so I had the idea to do bananas. Because, you know, I mean, they're just funny. I mean, you know, I mean, they're yellow, which is a great pop art color. Um, and it really started with, I, I did a piece, uh, the psycho shower scene was my very first one. Because I thought it would be really funny if, like, you know, the shower opens and there's a guy with a banana, like, and she's, like, screaming bloody murder at this banana. And so I painted that, and the whole time I was painting it, I was in tears laughing. It just made me laugh so hard that, um, I'm like, this has to be a series, and so I started it, I did The Shining, and I, I kept progressing with it, and it's, it's right now my favorite series because I love the idea behind it. I like that it's taking something that's really dark and negative and turning it into something really funny and light. I, I would really like to say I have a really deep history with art, and, and I have all this background. Um, I did go to art school, but it was kind of back in the day where they didn't believe you could make money off art unless you did advertising. And so I kind of got pushed into that and that wasn't what I wanted to do and it kind of killed it for me for a while. I would live for Saturday morning cartoons and you know, maybe about three or four years old, five, and I always draw these cartoons that I would see. I hope that people get that there's a good sense of humor behind it and that it's, it's meant to lighten up a room and it's meant to be fun. So far, the reactions have been really good, and if, the only reactions are just people love it, and or buy prints or you know whatever. And um, yeah, it's just really good. It, it's going really well. There's no goal in mind for me. It just you know when something inspires you, you just do it. My art is just to make people smile. That's it. I kind of really learned social media. I learned. You know, there's certain times of the day that are better to post. I learned how to target people on Facebook, which Facebook doesn't really work anymore. They, they got, it's, I avoid it. Um, they got greedy with their ads. That kind of faltered, but Instagram has been really well. Um, so yeah, there's like, you know, a whole science to it about tagging, about, uh, especially because I do a lot of celebrities and iconic people, you know, if you hashtag them or even the actors themselves have actually reposted my artwork of them. I, I think without social media, I, I, I don't even actually know how I, I would have done any of this. I think now, hopefully, people, especially younger people and younger artists, understand that you know, social media has allowed everybody to, to do what they want. I'm, I'm a huge advocate of it. If someone tells you something is wrong, there's, there's, there's no such thing as wrong in art. I want people to look at it and smile and laugh like Saturday morning cartoons.